morning. Oh, I've come over to this beautiful graveyard, churchyard, cemetery, whatever you want to call it, to film these and photograph these beautiful snowdrops this morning. Obviously, you're going to try and do it really sensitive, sensitively without trampling any snowdrops or standing on anybody in the cemetery. I did want to say sorry I haven't posted any videos for a few weeks, but I've had a problem. Um, well, you can hear from this clip here how bad it was. So I didn't know whether it was a microphone, the mic input on the camera or the cable that connects the camera to the microphone. So I ended up, obviously first thing you do is assume the worst, it's got to be the camera that's broken. And then you think, no it can't be that, it's probably either the microphone or the lead. So it turned out it was the lead, so I ordered a new lead and everything's okay now. But obviously, in the meantime, while I'm faffing around thinking about getting a new lead, I'm also thinking, hmm, maybe this is a good time to get a new microphone. And you think like, well, I don't really need a new microphone. I'm happy with the one I've got. But that nagging thought never goes away. And a new lead was, it's not a lot of money, but, it's sort of a little chunk towards a new microphone. So in the end I had a word of myself and just bought a new lead so we're back on the original microphone if any of that makes sense. So that's the reason I haven't posted and also it's been really windy every night I've had available to go out it's not been right or it's been raining so I kind of lost a bit of like a bit of enthusiasm um, but a break was good and I'm keen to get back on it so this is the first video of hopefully a bit more motivated filmmaking and photography. So what I'm looking for is a really nice snowdrop that is on the edge of the bluebells here bluebells, I've got bluebells on my mind, um, that is edge, on the edge of the snowdrops here because I don't want to go off trampling things in there. The other thing is if I pick one here I can probably get a nice backdrop of these in the background and there's a slight slope here so I can get the camera looking up under the snowdrop with any luck. Oh, I've got my camera set up here, Nikon Z5 with the 40mm f2 lens on. I'm currently trying to focus on this little snowdrop here. So let's take that shot and see what comes out. I've moved to a slightly different spot now because I'm going to try and get a photograph of this snowdrop here hopefully looking up and getting a bit of blurry background so let's give that a go I've changed the composition and moved the tripod a little bit to focus on a different snowdrop so let's get that shot What I'm going to do now is put my 20mm f1.8 G lens on and just see how close I can get with that. I should really have bought my macro extension tubes today but I forgot because I'm an idiot. So we're doing close up photography rather than macro photography today. Ooh, switch the camera off. There. Take that cap off there. Oh, 
Why are these caps so awkward? The most delicate thing you can do and the cap on the back of the lens is just a pain in the bottom. Right, ready. Right, so obviously I've got my 20mm lens on, I've had to move the tripod a little bit and try and get really close to this snowdrop here. So let's take that shot and see what comes out. Gonna underexpose it a little bit I think because we've got the sky in the background. Right, see what that's like. Not convinced that's in focus, so let's try again. Tell you what I might do is put this in crop sensor mode so that will give me about 30mm with the 20mm lens and might be able to get in really close. Right, so just going to try and bend this little guy out of the way a little bit because he is distracting the edge of my shop. I think we might have something there. Let's have a check. Well, today was just about getting back out with the camera and getting in the habit of taking some photos again. I've been a bit unenthusiastic lately just because of the weather and various things. Um, hopefully be able to get back out and do some astrophotography soon because that's really my passion but it seemed a shame to not come and photograph some of the snowdrops that are around at this time of year wouldn't want to let them slip by so you never really know what photographs you get until you get home and start editing I think I've got some good ones but who knows Thank you for watching and see you again soon.